Yeah, I think the cyber security product are, you know, the foundation of the way they operate has been uh, deeply on machine learning. So machine learning is something which we have been using in cyber security product for many years. And in fact, that is the only reason why we are still relevant and we've been able to stop uh, the modern uh, threats which are unfolding. Uh, AI, of course, is new, uh, new technology and uh, it will help us to further revolutionize the way in terms of how human interact with uh, cyber technologies. Uh, also simplify, you know, reduce, uh, reduce the need for uh, high-end training uh, and configuration requirements and uh, democratize the way cyber security products are being used. So I, AI obviously creates a very great opportunity for us to, uh, for, for real simplify, uh, you know, how we, uh, uh, you know, make the future of uh, cyber security products. And also more importantly, uh, you know, reduce the dependency on humans uh, who can make mistakes or errors while configuring or operating solutions by putting AI uh, to the job, who, which can do it more efficiently and more consistently. So you're being creative with AI, you're very optimistic about it. You're very, very optimistic about AI. In fact, at Quick Heal, uh, we have been adopting uh, AI for many years now. Uh, our uh, patented GoDeep.ai uh, is a foundation of all the different AI models that are powering various products of ours. Uh, we have a very strong uh, data science team which is constantly looking at innovative ways to come out with different models uh, to, to power our products and solutions uh, for our customers. Wonderful, sir. So what are your margin expansion plans currently? See, basically, if you look at it, uh, you know, we have been um, having running our core technologies and also investing uh, into the new, new modern solutions and modern products uh, for our customers. So, so in a way, whatever uh, our core technology are deeply profitable, uh, but we have you know moved that profit into investments, uh, which uh, will serve us for building future technologies, right? Okay. And and so therefore, uh, one of the things that we have constantly talked about is that we will focus on profitable growth, and that is what we've been delivering quarter on quarter for last uh, so many years, and we will continue to do that. Now, uh, while we do that. We know that uh, as we start investing and putting more and more modern technologies into the market, we will find that the rate of growth of our revenues will be far higher uh, than the rate of growth of our cost. Uh, we feel very comfortable with the way in which we are manage managing our cost and we will continue to do that so that we have a fine balance between cost, growth and revenue. And over a period of time, you can expect that to grow and you will have much better EBITDA margins coming up in future.